everyone, so I've got a kind of like um, quick vlogish type of video for, to, for you today. So <clears throat> basically I'm just telling you about um, Panoxyl, how now it's back in the UK. So all, everyone who suffers from acne and has used um, Panoxyl before like me, then you'll obviously be happy to know that it's back if you did use it. and. Um, was annoyed at that point where they stopped um, producing it and um, distributing it in the UK. So if you've seen um, my acne video about how I got rid of my um, severe cystic acne, you'll know that I am an avid user of Panoxyl. But um, ever since I was living in Brazil, I, I wasn't using it that much because I had like... Um, a stock I had a stock of it that I had bought um, when I was in the UK at some point but they do sell it in Brazil <clears throat> excuse me um, but I just had a stock of it so I didn't really need to buy any while I was out in Brazil um, and my skin was pretty good so I only had to really use it maybe like twice a week and at the time that my skin was quite good I was on the pill so that obviously was helping um, then last year I came off the pill and of course my body had to adjust and um, all the home hormones and everything so my skin has been kind of um, initially it was fine but like quite a few months later maybe like six months seven months down the line my skin started to purge a bit and then coming back to the UK and having the whole um, different climate and everything and getting used to different routine my skin um, wasn't really doing too well so um, I was annoyed because I couldn't get a hold of Panoxyl I do use Quinoderm um, it does have benzoyl peroxide in it like the Panoxyl one but um, for me my holy grail acne treatment is Panoxyl so that was annoying um, so I went back to using Quinoderm and then I was checking online and everything and then I had seen on like quite a few online pharmacies that um, Panoxyl was on there so I was like okay then it's been reproduced and um, redistributed in the UK so I did a little bit of research and I saw that the uh, the company that makes Panoxyl so it's um, Stifle if you can see that at the top there sorry uh, I'll write it down here and um, they had responded to quite a few um, forum posts Facebook posts and say saying that um, they were slowly re redistributing Panoxyl so I went to Boots unfortunately Boots still hasn't got Panoxyl in e every Boots that I've been to none of them are stocking Panoxyl but I got this from just a normal chemist so if you try a local chemist, um, they they I think they're more likely to have um, Panoxyl rather than Boots. But online, you can probably buy Panoxyl from online chemists. However, the only one that I've been able to get my hand on is the Pan Panoxyl 10 Aqua Gel, and this is the really really strong one because obviously it's 10 percent. So you have to be really careful when you use this if you do use this on your whole face which I don't recommend I was using it a little bit it will dry your skin out like like a snake so um, be very very careful this is extremely drying um, while I was doing this for like a few days over my whole face I was using this epiderm cream and this is really good I used to use E45 but I saw this and I thought I'd try it out and I love this I've actually been using it as an eye cream it's so moisturizing and if you've got dry sensitive skin I would definitely recommend this as a, a moisturizer so try this out if you haven't tried this for um, dry really really dry or sensitive skin because it doesn't have um, any unnecessary ingredients like fragrance that type of thing so um, try this out if you've got really dry dry skin and if you're on benzoyl peroxide and it's really drying out your skin try um, Epiderm out um, so I'm still waiting to see if they're gonna 
released the other version, so the 5. And to be more specific, um, the one that I really did like, or the one for me that was the Holy Grail, was the Panoxyl 5 um, Acne Cream, I think it's called the Acne Cream. So the Aqua Gel is, is kind of like lilac here, and the other one is um, an orange colour. So this one, um, as it's described in Acne Gel, it's got a sort of like um, creamy gel texture to it. And the other one has got a more um, kind of like a, a thin lotion type of texture. And to me, that was the best ever acne treatment. But I am still using Quinoderm. I use this every night at the moment to try and control my acne, and it's been helping. And then I use this Panoxyl. 10% acne gel for as a topical treatment so um, just to let you guys know that if you're a panoxyl fan like me then start checking out your local pharmacies your local chemists and online and um, hopefully soon the whole range will be back so yeah sorry it was a bit of a rambly video but I thought I would do this in order to help fellow acne sufferers um, so yeah give me a thumbs up if you found it useful and I'll see you in my next video bye